Alright y'all, uh, today I'm going to review the Diode Exist. This is the previous model, they just came out with the new one. Uh, good news is, with the new one there's not much difference with the new one and the one that I'm reviewing. I'm doing a review on this one because I put a substantial amount of time on it. Uh, I've caught over a thousand fish on this uh, reel. I've probably about 10,000 casts, rough estimate. But for a while, this was the number one rod that I'd use. For a while I was using this about 90 percent of the time which is why I even have this reel I'm gonna let you guys know that this is an expensive reel for anyone it is very very expensive the new one that just came out I think it retails for something like 850 I bought this one used I bought this one used from the tackle trap a guy came in with a whole bunch of uh, practically brand new Daiwa exists uh, the tackle trap is an authorized Daiwa repair uh, center and uh, I saw them on the website. It's about 25% off. I was like, man, this is this is be, this be my reel, you know. This is what I use the most. I had three rods sit in the corner of my room. I wasn't using. I sold them on Marketplace. I ended up buying this reel. That being said, is this reel worth the money? Yes. If this is what you want, if you want the best of the best, this reel is worth the money. Every time I cast, I reel, there is a level of smoothness that I have never seen before. All my friends that get to use this rod, not many people ever get to touch this rod, but the ones that I have, they use it, they can't set it down. They talk about how smooth it is when you catch a fish. The drag, the drag is different. The drag is in a world of its own. If I got six pound mono on here, if you use light line, this reel will save you fish. I've caught a really big striper on six pound test mono that I probably would have lost. I hooked one about the same size on a dial with the Tula LT and I lost it. Um, big fish, I mean, not just big fish, but just about fish in general. When you're fishing them on light line and you finally start to get them up, when they first see the boat, they, they're notorious for that one last charge back down that charge is split second they bulldog down if your drag is not smooth on this light line a lot of times it'll break I have been saved a couple of times with this reel I heard reviews in the past from people saying you're, you're gonna lose fish if you don't have you know this reel or like a Essex or Sir Tate reels like that and I was I was trying to buy, be naive and just be like, no, that's not true. I catch I catch bigs on anything. No, it happened to me a couple times. Pop, pop, uh, Lake Norman, big spots and stripers. But um, yeah, this reel has saved me a couple of times. Uh, like I said, I've caught about a thousand fish on here, if not more, and it's just as smooth as the day I got it. That's a true testament. The drag is just as silky. Um, that being said, man. This is not the real for everyone and pound for pound dollar for dollar it is not my suggestion I bought this reel because I wanted to experience the best of the best and I did would I buy another dial exist no I'm not made full of money like I said I had to sell three rods to even get this reel and I got it used but it truly is the best of the best if I had to make my decision on what's the best reel to buy without a deal it's going to be the Dio Lubius there's another version of Lubius the Lubius Arity that one is phenomenal that one is phenomenal if you want to stay lower in the price range Banford if you want to go down a little bit more uh, Ultegra those two are Shimano's the other the other ones are, are Dio I, I just like the Dio higher end reels once you get to a certain price point the Shimano's aren't bad, they're just a little heavier. Um, and I don't know, I'm just, I have just as many Shimano's as I have Daiwa's when it comes to my rod collection and reel collection. But I'm a big fan of these higher end Daiwa's. Trying to think of some other things too. Um, some of these higher end reels that are coming out, there's the Abu Garcia Xenon spinning reel. It's light. They're really pushing these Xenon reels to be light, light, light. Light doesn't always mean better. Um, in hand, this reel is smoother than the Xenon spinning reel. 
I mean, this is the old model. It's the old model. If you can find a deal on an old existing, this is what you want. You want the best of the best. Go for it. You're not losing much. <laughs> Besides a, a big old chunk in your pocket and maybe your kidney. But something special about this rod. I always recommend everybody has their specific technique that they enjoy. If you have just that one technique that stands out way like above and beyond compared to other techniques, whether it's jig, whether it's I always tell people to invest in a quality setup for that because you're just gonna enjoy it more, you're gonna use it more. And this is that rod for me, rod and reel. It's the Kissler Z-Bone. Um, this is not the best of the best rod but it's one of them. Uh, I believe the, the NRXs and, and the P5s for certain applications definitely eclipse the Z-Bone, but I got this rod 40% off. Let's get back to the reels though. Weight isn't everything. Don't go off the weight. It's gonna be a little bit heavier than your Xenon, but it's gonna be way smoother. On a scale of one to 10, I'm trying to make quicken up this video it's my first time ever doing this I'm trying to shorten this video up for you I mean one out of ten is this is ten out of ten ten out of ten you know working for your money it takes a big old dent in my pocket I, I said I wouldn't do it again I'd get Lubius I have a Vanford I, I just got Lubius LT but I get the Lubius Arity if I wanted super high end is there any competing with this no there's not. Um, that's pretty much all I have to say about this, man. If this is what you want, if you want the Ferrari fishing reels, this is it. You can still enjoy a Mustang GT. You can still enjoy Camaro. You can still enjoy Audi R8. But if you want that Ferrari, this is it. 